Okay, in the previous video, we introduced the T drive. Today, we will spend more time to get familiar with the Kelvin T drive's software and the user interface. So you can see the 12 inch display. This is the color display, touch screen, and also here you can see the full keyboard. Okay, but I really prefer to use the touch screen because uh, you know the touch screen makes everything so easy. For example, on the top, if you want to input patient's info, click patient's name. Uh, use the virtual keyboard. Uh, let's put uh, Max and technician is. Uh, Toby today, Toby, B Y. Okay, so birthday is right, ID is right. I'm not going to put weight height and uh, blood pressure. Enter. Okay, so you can see max info, and um, also you can see some hints. For example, no paper. So what we do is that uh, we are gonna load the paper. Today we will use the roller paper. But however, you can use the Z fold paper as well. This machine is compatible with both paper. Here is the printer. Here is the printer compartment. Take it off. This is a very small design. We have the spring inside. So uh, you, can, you, you can use two 10 millimeters paper or you can use two 16 millimeter paper. It is compatible. So you can see it's very easy to load the paper in this machine. Okay. So all right. So next step is uh, you put the electrodes on the patient, you want to change some setting. For example, uh, you want to change the EMG filter. You don't need to go to the menu, you just press the shortcuts. Okay, so for example, I want to turn the EMG filter up from 25. I'm going to change it to 45. And uh, I want to change the gain. Now it's the auto. I want to change it to 5 millimeters per microvolts. I want to change the, uh, let me see. Okay, you have a few options to change the printing format. We prefer to use a three times four plus one reason on one page. Okay? So uh, everything is ready. What you do is uh, what you you do is uh, print the choose the printing key, this uh, big green button. Okay? Okay, so uh, you can see uh, the machine will give you some hints. Sampling is it it going to take uh, ten seconds? Now it's analyzing. Finally, the recording. So uh, it prints. Okay. All right. So. Okay, this is a very nice report. On the top left corner, you will see the patient's information. On the right, you will see the measurement result, Minnesota code, and the interpretation result. Also, you will see, for sure, you will see 12 channel ECG waveform and the reason, and also the settings, what kind of a filter you have been using in this uh, examination okay all right so uh, a few things we want to emphasize is the, the, the user interface because of the touch screen so uh, you have the advantage over other other machines for example if you don't know uh, how to use this machine press the help key you'll see the building 
user menu. Okay, very convenient. If you want to review the previous uh, exams, press the file key. You can see all the ECG waveforms saved in this machine. If you want to change the settings, some detailed settings of the machine, press menu. For example, you want to, um, let's say, change the printing. You can turn the measurement result off. Oh, sorry. You can turn off the interpretation. My finger is too big. Um, for example, if you want to preview before you do the report printing, you can turn it on. Print preview. Okay. Press OK. And uh, yes, you can change some other settings. For example, you can change change different work modes. You can turn off the demo. You can change the hot limits of this machine. All right. So uh, that's all about the software. Really easy to use. Okay. Thank you.